uh, what are my chances of beating it? And how long do I have? Okay. Uh, thank you. Sam, 25. These pretzels are making me thirsty. <laughs> Seinfeld, anyone? I'm dying. Anyone want to hang out? Sarah, 24. Fashion blogger. Loves the beach. Oh my god, you're not actually dying, are you? That is so sad. My condolences. One time I thought I was gonna die, but... I just drank too much at a party. I just had to get my stomach pumped. It was not that big of a deal. But that was my third time being in the hospital. The first... Faith, 26. God is love. What you're doing isn't funny. I would like to send you a very long list of verses I think would be very applicable. Mm -hmm. Live, 20. I'm a bitch. Fuck you. NYU 2021. Sure. Where do you want to meet? You're shorter than I thought you'd be. Your profile did say you'd be a bitch. I like your shoes. Thanks. What do they say? A bunch of shit. Nice. Oh, I don't smoke. Aren't you dying? Good point. <coughs> Ugh. You don't use like a jewel? Ew. Sorry. my dad. My mom died when I was 11. I'm sorry. I started to photograph dead things after that. You know, like plants, animals. My therapist says this is how I deal with grief, but he's a fucking idiot. Anyway, I got pretty good at it and got into NYU. Is that why you're out with me today? Because I'm dying. How are your parents? They're good people. Both paranoid. Mm. They live in California. Have you told them yet? Nope. Are you going to? Not sure. Mm. I wouldn't. Sounds like an ordeal. Hey, you want to get food? Yeah. I think I'm going to get the chicken sandwich. Is there a chance you could survive? 2%. How long did they give you? Six months. What is it? Brain tumor. So do you just want to fuck me or something? What? Isn't that why you're on Tinder? You're dying and you want to get all your crazy sexual fantasies out before I- No, jeez. Look, I won't do anal, but if you want me to fuck you with a strap on, I will. <laughs> no, seriously, it's fine. Um, huh. I guess I don't know why I did it. Just kind of acted on impulse. Do they want you to do chemo? No point. Just prolonging the inevitable deterioration of my body. I'm rotting from the inside out. Can I get the chicken sandwich? Same for me. What? Just thinking about the chicken. Never thought about it before. You know, the chicken. 
Its whole life was lived just to die, chopped up, dipped in ketchup, be eaten by some guy. Now it's gonna happen to me. Not the chopping up and eating part, you know, but I'm gonna die, just like the chicken. But its death comes with avocado and artisan bread, though. Good point. I might just kill myself. Really? Yeah. How would you do it? Gun? Too messy. I feel bad for whoever would have to clean that up. Mm -hmm. I could hang myself, but I don't know how to make a noose. You could Google it. I guess. Maybe jumping out my window. You think a gun is messy? Oh, yeah. I've thought about killing myself, too. Why's that? Stick it to my fucking dad. Also, I can't pay fucking student loans. What? What? I mean, come on. What? Those are pretty terrible reasons. Don't you think you're giving it a little too easily? Fuck you, my reasons are just as valid as yours. I'm terminally ill. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, with a 2% chance of survival, you're giving in too. Are you really trying to compare my brain tumor to your daddy issues? Fuck off. No, I'm just saying, suicide is permanent. Death is permanent. You don't respawn in the back of the map. It's not a video game, you know that, right? Everything that you have ever done becomes nothing. Anything that you've ever done or want to do, you're done, okay? I'm staring down the barrel at 25 and you're 20, right? Something like that, and you wanna off yourself? Are you kidding me? That's bullshit. You know it's ridiculous. Go out and do something with your life. Go enjoy yourself. Explore. I don't know. Do what I can't do. It. The bon and avocado really do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, what do you want to do? Today? in general, before you croak? I don't know. It's a pretty big question. I have to think about it. Mm -hmm. Anything off the top of your head? I always wanted to go skydiving. God, be more basic. Wow, you really are an asshole. <laughs> Cards on the table. I got nothing to lose. I don't know. I guess, travel, photograph endangered species, just like solidify them before they're gone forever. Mm. How pleasant. You're usually just an asshole on the inside. Maybe just try that. What are you gonna do, kill me? Yeah. yeah. I'll do it. Right here, right now. Give me your camera. I'll solidify it for you. Let's do some New York stuff. Dorsey stuff I never did because I thought it was fucking stupid. Okay. You think what I'm thinking?
shame what they do to those horses. I agree. Hey, fuck you! Free the horses! Free the Free horses. horses! Free the horses! Free the horses! Fuck oh, you! You fucking bitch! Fuck you! Kiss it! You stupid fucks! What do you think it means? Hmm. Well, it is a commentary on right-wing fascism and the country's ability to destroy millions of lives using crude oil. Hmm. Do you see a vagina? I totally see a vagina. Are you just gonna make fun of all of the art in the gallery? Yeah, I mean, he's dying, so. Six months. Yeah. To live, it's. 2% chance, it's a. Welcome to New York City. Huh? Everyone's dying here. So, fuck your dad, huh? Yep. Why? I caught him throwing away my application to NYU. Art is for the kids who sit alone at the lunch table. There's no career for those kids. That's what he said. He wanted me to just go to some community college and get a bullshit degree and eventually just become a housewife. Yeah. Fuck your dad. He also got remarried after my mom died. Well, a lot of people get remarried. Two months. Two months after. Turns out he was fucking her before the accident, so it all just worked out for him, didn't it? He needs a divorce when you have a drunk dude behind an 18-wheeler. That sucks. It did. It still does, thank you. Sorry for calling it daddy issues earlier, too. You know, if I knew, of course I wouldn't have. Is this all real? What? Are you really dying? Yeah. Why would I lie about that? I don't know, some... Weird dark humor dating app shit. I haven't really been sure all day. Well, sorry to burst your bubble. Why aren't you more upset? I don't know. I cry like six times a day. I cry when my internet goes out. You seem like fine. Aren't you scared? I don't know. What are you gonna do with all your stuff? I don't know. Guess I really haven't had the chance to think about it yet. When are you going to do it? What? Oh. <sighs> uh, probably.
probably sooner rather than later. You know, I don't want to have to tell my parents about the, so. It's probably best just to rip the bandaid off all at once, you know? You shouldn't do it. At least I don't think you should. Death is permanent, remember? Try for that 2% chance. Coming from the person who threatened her own life like five times earlier. I had to work hard to talk that knife away from your neck. See, this is why I didn't want to say anything. Thank you, by the way. You know, for this, today, it's just, it's nice to have a friend. Hey, if you want to push off offing yourself, I don't have anything to do tomorrow. Sorry. Hello? Uh, okay. Thank you. What? Migraines. What? Migraines. Sam, what the fuck are you talking about? I have migraines. They mixed up my file with some other guys. They told him he has migraines, but he has a brain tumor. Now they have to tell him he has a brain tumor. Oh my God. He has a 2% chance of beating it. I, I just have the migraines. Oh. You're not dying. I can't keep this. Hey, you still free tomorrow?